with the TV. So it does to the other people that contains from the 1970s and And most of the time I'm seeing this stuff censored all the way. And every time that the those uh, censor censoring appear, there came a small elephant load about this and they dangled on the corner of the TV. So what does that mean? So is that the that's the new law that we are trying to implement. Now, what I'm saying is there's a direct way of saying something and there's an indirect way of saying something. The direct way is direct. We can say, don't do that. <coughs> but when there's an indirect way, how can we stop that? So, what I'm trying to mention is this. If we try to stop things by bringing in new law, people, I mean, there are people who will find ways. If, if you are going to get to that door and every one of you are blocking my path on this passage, I will find some way. I will go, go around this, this way or this way somewhere. But at the end of the day, people are smart. People have the ability to understand and get to whatever they want. Now, I remember in my school days, to put my classmates on that. We used to bring phones. Uh, we we called our as the Anglican Martinians and we we brought the phones to the schools. And most of us got caught. And I remember just before the end, I was uh, kneeling in front of the corridor for three hours because my friend brought brought a uh, phone. The thing was, we it was it, it was prohibited. It was not allowed, but we did that. Why do, why do we need to do that? Because it was a necessity at the time. We had to call our friends. If, if there was a cancellation, we would let's say, I mean, I can't come here at this time. <laughs> Something like that. So, the basic fundamental, what I'm trying to focus is that laws are not a good way to uh, hinder a, a person. A person will find a way. A person has the ability to do that. So what we need to do is educate it. They should know, now, we are doing this, this is good, this is bad, it depends on the person. For me, what I see as good is not what Amila teaches. Yeah, the, the values are different. What we must try to do is shape up a, a certain amount of values among each personality so that everyone knows, everyone knows that there is a certain, uh, certain, that there is a certain uh, understanding of a common value, a moral system. So that's uh, that's what I'm going to say. That if we bring such law, it's not going to make it a better place. It's not going to make it a beautiful place. It's going to make it a worse place. Thank you.